G'day! Welcome back to Space Engineers! This is episode 4! So guys, last flaming episode, we built this monstrosity of a mining ship you can see in front of you. Now, don't forget, it is my very first vehicle or ship or anything built on Space Engineers. Yep, that's right, I'm a noob. Um, and we still managed to build it and test fly it. And it was successful. We couldn't go down because we forgot the down thruster. But I fixed that by adding a down thruster already on the back. There you go. It's got a down thruster now. We'll take it for a test run in a sec. Make sure that down thruster is actually functioning. Um, as Yeah, as you can see, it is just my very first creation. Uh, haven't tested the mining drills yet because she is nicknamed the mining turtle for a reason. She's I was going to put a shell on the top of it, you know, and like a turtle sort of thing. Yeah, well, she's called the Mining Turtle. Um, so our drills are not even hooked into any sort of cargo yet. Holy smokes. Uh, yeah, so we're going to continue on this this episode. Uh, very soon, I really want to go up in the hills and create an actual base. Because right now, we're, we're sort of on an outpost. That's right, we're on an outpost. There's no real base. But this thing, hopefully is gonna be our ticket because I'm sick of mining manually. During the night time in this game, all I've been doing is going between all the ores, bringing them back to our outpost here, and literally processing them and telling the, uh, the assembler, or the crafting table, to do, you know, make hundreds of stuff. So I've made hundreds of stuff in advanced here. Um, yeah, and I'm sitting about 12k iron right now, which is not too bad. But yeah, that's all I've been doing during the night time. Waiting for it to come day. Now it's finally come day. I thought, perfect. Time to jump in another episode and uh, see what we could do with our mining turtle here before continuing. So, let's go ahead and get started, shall we? Um, first things first, I want to test the up-down thruster. Now, I'm a little bit worried because the battery packs on this girl is flashing red. Now, I did do a little bit of research and apparently there's a connector we could build on our outpost here and our ship and they connect together and then any power that we're producing in the outpost can charge the battery so that's a that's a bonus so we've got to sort of figure that out and um, obviously figure the connector out holy smokes obviously we've got a, a little bit to go if you ask me about figuring everything out um yeah batteries and charging and 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 storage and yeah. Oh, and apparently we're meant to be putting a ore detector on the front of this thing so it can actually detect ores when we're flying around. Uh, but first things first, going in the ship, uh, we're going to turn it on by pressing uh, Y. Online. Everything is online. Perfect. Okay. Going through a third party view here. Oh, yep. Perfect. Oh, it's glitching all over the place. That's okay. Woohoo. All right. So she's online. Um, let's take off the landing gear. Done. She should be offline now. Alright, we have taken off. I think we just destroyed something, but... <laughs> yep, whoopsie, the takeoff was a bit rough there. Alright, so we're online. And we're flying, as you can see. But now, look, we have a thruster that goes down. Woohoo! Okay. Well, apparently got three minutes at full thrust. Of power left so that's not a good sign uh, I'm not gonna take her anywhere or turn anything on I think but that there's perfect um, take it down a bit let her hover she's about 15 minutes hover because I gotta fix something let it hover she's hovering still quick yep thank you keep hovering keep hovering I've got to fix Do I, I need I need some steel plate quick whoopsie I gotta quickly fix the hole I just make so the landing gear doesn't like you know come through the other side if if you know what I mean I think I fixed it there we go I think I ripped something out I don't know I'm, st I'm a noob I'm still working on it all right jump in the cockpit and go down thrust down thrust down thrust down we should be hitting boom okay we've successful hit put the brake on so we... oh for freak's sake data stop pressing buttons all right go forward a bit go forward a bit Alright, down a bit. Bring it offline. Bring it offline. Bring it off. What, what, what button am I pressing? T. What's T do? I don't know. Alright, she's now offline. And putting the brake on. I think the brake... 
the loading gear is unlocked. Loading gear is locked. There. Okay. All right. So I've been doing it back to front. Noob data. <laughs> I need to, to read that that more. But there we Oh, only two of them are locked. One of them are locked. Is green locked? I think green's locked. She's a bit... Oh, that's why she... <laughs> Oops. Um, can we fix that? Probably not. Ah, oh, that's going to drive me crazy if we don't f just fix that and then land. All right. Okay. V. Um, the gear's unlocked now. Ship is online. All right. What? Is unlocked. A broken stuff already. Hover, hover. All right. Let it hover for a second. All right. Fix up the damage I just did. Come on. Connect. There you go. There you go. There you go. Oh, alright, no more noob mistakes, Data. Alright. Head back on. Bring her down. Turn her offline. Perfect. She's completely offline and on the ground. Aha. Uh -huh. Alright, now we can finally get started. So the ups and downs do work. Okay, so let's research this connector now, shall we? Whoop, I'm crouching. Um, connector. Connect progression. All right, I've obviously haven't unlocked the connector yet. Where is it? Where would it be under? Connect. All right, hang on. We are after connector. It's obviously down here somewhere. And ooh, okay. Pistons. Ooh, that's that's cool. All right, pistons. I think I'm going. Oh, not. We haven't gone past it yet. Or have we? Uh -huh. Oh, here we go. Oh, found it. Right there. Connector. No, we haven't unlocked it. So I think we need to build a small conveyor or a conveyor junction. What have we got to build? Small cargo. I'm pretty sure we've unlocked all this. Yeah, we've, we've unlocked all this. So we need to build a, a small... I think it. I think the plus sign means it goes down into here. Well, the sun's out, because I want the c connector which is here, and it'll unlock all that. So I'll build a conveyor junction and see if it does that. I don't really need a conveyor right now. All right, fine. Uh, yeah, well, not f that. Conveyor junction. Conveyor junction. Junction. Small conveyor. Ah, oh, here it is. There's got a plus on it. Okay. Conveyor junction. I'm just gonna. I'm just going to place that down for now. You know, I need a small one, please. Give me a small one. Why do, why, why give me a gigantic one to build? I, st I need the uh, interior plate to place this down. All right, interior plate it is. Uh, interior plate, 100 of them, please. And I'd come back here and pop that on there. All right, weld that sucker together. Really, it costs that much to put this junction together all right fine you know what i've got i've got some things i'm pretty rich so you know 100 of these small tubes and motors that's all we need that's all we need small tubes and motors motors small tubes perfect now we should have unlocked the section while i'm hoping come on there we go i've unlocked new blocks that's what i wanted i've got a a junction on the back Unknown signal detected. Um, okay, so now we should be able to go. I keep pressing wrong buttons. I'm so used to playing Minecraft. Now, oh, it has unlocked new stuff. What the hell? Connector. Perfect. I'll put this instead of the thruster. Holy crap. Look at the size of the connector. That is, oh, it gets bigger. That's a big connector. What's a little connector? That's okay. It's a medium connector. I think it's got to go on a large cargo hole. Is that connect correct? No. Or is it? I need steel plate to place it, and it wouldn't go that way anyway. Obviously. All right. So what happens if we were to grind our batteries off? Because we'll build new ones. All right. So put our stuff away. All right. I've got an idea. Got a plan. Stay with me, guys. I have a plan to get us mining in no time. Alright, grind the battery away. Buy battery. There, she's got no battery now. We can easily build new ones. Alright, battery's now gone. Perfect. Alright, we'll have to relocate that on our little mining turtle in a sec. 
Now bring out a... Do we have it already? No. Large cargo. That's exactly what I want. Um, did I just press that? There. Can I put a lot? Yes, I can. That's freaking huge. What do, I, what do I need? I need interior plate just to place it. Oh, I press pause. Whoopsie. Hang on. All right, now... Don't need that. I need interior plate this time. Okay, fine. Um, now, number eight. Number eight. Thank you. All right. It looks like I can place it. Can we place it further back on the mining ship here? That would be cool. And if we can... Nope. Flip it around. Flip it around. All right. Where's the... Just checking all the connections, guys. So we've got a large connection there. Large connection there. Large connection there. Small connection on the front. Right? Right. So once if we do that. Perfect. So there's a large connection directly underneath. And we've placed that nice and snug backwards. You know, plenty of room. Uh, these things require a lot, doesn't it? Alright, but that's okay. We've got plenty of resources. There we go. That's coming along. Yep, that's nice, nice. Alright, we need computers, motors, displays, and comp. Uh, whatever the freak they are. Um, okay, so we need computers. Yep, 100 of those will do. Uh, those. And what, what else did it want? Oh, flame and glove, I forgot. Well, we'll just take those two over now. Put those... Ah, motors and displays. Jeez, not going to need much displays, but that's fine. Uh, put those back. Get the displays out. Space credits, no. Uh, displays got 95 of them um and motors got nine almost 800 of those bad boys i really need to change the color i've been doing gray and red so far on this theme build done she should if we can yep we have access to a very large container on the ship i don't think it is is large no it's not as large as our biggest one here but she's she that's still quite large if you ask me so now what I'm thinking, guys, um, can we go underneath now and, like, cut? Hang on. We make sure this is connected first. Uh, ah, well, I need steel plate. Hang on, hang on. All right, put some of this junk back. Steel plate. Thank you. Just going to make sure it's going to be connected by the back here. There we go. I think that means it's connected. I'm not 100% sure. Yeah, I think it's that that's connected. All right, we'll take the risk. So what I'm going to do now underneath, hopefully grind some of these off. All right, come under a belly here. Hello. Yep. Okay, we're looking. All right, straighten on up. Can we get to underneath it without killing what we just did? I'm trying not to kill it. All right, I see, I see, I see, I see. Found it. That's what I was after. See that connection port? We could just get rid of these ones here. Look at that. Right underneath her. Yeah, I'm sorry my inventory's full. Am I getting rid of that? Yes, I know inventory's full. I don't care. Weld these two together. There we go, reinforcing the hole. Alright, so we've got a connection underneath. Can we put a connector on there now? Alright, put ourselves up the, probably the right way. Um, okay, so we're so close. Flip. Oh, look at that! The connector connects onto the cargo bay right there perfectly. Perfect, she's just under the belly too. We could probably fly and connect. Hopefully she holds up. Alright, weld it together. We're going to need motors, small pipes, and con construction comp. All right. That's no problem. Head on over here. We could probably get rid of the displays and the steel. Put the motors on and... Whew, display. Don't need that many, but hey. And construction. Put those there. Thank you. Perfect. I think I got enough now. I think we're gone to something, guys. We're on to something. All right, weld that sucker together. Oh, computers and small steel pipes. All right. Ow, ow, ow. 
coming out of there. Still don't even know how to connect it to the base. Don't even think we have enough power to do this, to be honest. Um, small steel pipes, yep. And computers, please. I don't know, I keep grabbing the... I could... I'm not good at memorizing how much I need, or else I'll just carry how much I need on me, if you know what I mean. Alright, look at that. Perfect. And grab those back while we're down here, just to stop wasting. Now, yep, that's connected. See, connector, cockpit, a large cargo container. Perfect. She's all connected together. She's got some... Yeah, perfect. Look at that. So if we put some pipes coming probably out over here, we need to put batteries probably there. All right. Okay. All right. Um, but first off, we need to charge her. Well, we need to... Okay. Probably... Yeah. Come out the back here. All right. I'm landing for a sec because I need to research. So what do we need? Probably a large pipe. Oh, where's a large pipe? Conveyor tube, I think they're called. All right. And a turn corner thingy. Perfect. All right. Got turn corner thingy and pipes. Oh, interior plate. All right. All right, interior plate. All right, throw those in there. Computers, interior plate. All right, carry as much as we can. All right, we'll build the little dock out the back here, if you know what I mean. Just away from everything. So, boom, 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 boom. See? Well, I can't screw up now. I could land on this thing. Um, all right, now I'm going to flip this flipperoonie. Done. And then put a connector on... Is that a connector? Connector. Wrong way, Data. Wrong way. Connector directly on it. Ah, I need steel plate to construct that. Okay, no problem. Alright, put as much as we can of this together. There we go. We need motors. Out the yard, zoo. These things require lots of motors. Alright. Now quickly... Can, can we, we can't access through there? No. We can access through there. Okay. Grab motors. We'll do motors first. And... Um, units. Alright. Now come along. Weld these together. Okay, that's one. Hopefully this is strong enough to uh, support this new... Uh, support the mining turtle. Come on! How bad is this going to be if this thing just snaps? Should we put, re we put reinforcements in? I think we might need to do that. Alright. More, more of these, please. Thank you. More of just... Yeah, as much of these as possible. Seems to take up a lot. Alright, another one done. That's functionable. Or fun online, I should say. There we go. Now, that one's online. Corner one. Alright, so I need steel now, don't I? Just to build the... Connector, don't I? Um, steel. Okay, now we need to put the connector on the end. I think I might reinforce this. I have a bad feeling. I don't. I don't think this game has like snapping the cat. Oh, because you can crash a ship and snap it in half. So you're probably fine. You could easily break something. All right. So I might reinforce it with some things. But we need just more steel plate. Tons of steel plate, actually. Let's get that over and done. Then, yeah. Still plate, please. Tons of it. Thank you. Put the motors back. Put those back. Tons of steel plate. Couple hundred will do. Wow. Is this the biggest one? Should I have built the smaller one? I don't know. Connector. It's magnet. So it should sit on this, crack, if I'm correct. Um, small tube and computers. Alright. Small tube and computers. Computers? Thank you. Plenty of those. Right. Done. Alright, can we... Do we have enough to... Alright, we've got steel plate. So what I'm going to do, because I'm just a little bit nervous that something's going to break. What do I need? Unavailable to... Uh, unavailable. Okay. You can't place it on that. I can place it there. They don't... It doesn't connect to that. Ah. See, I can connect it to that, no problem. Okay, I'm going to reinforce this. Because that's connected to that, right? So I'm going to bring that out like that. And probably on this side too. Look at that. Reinforcing our little area here. And I'll put a bum on it now. Connecting it, hopefully, to the world. Can I? Can I? Yep. 
There, it's connected to the world. Ha ha! I did it! Alright, now we should be able to access the entire base through this. Yes, we are. Look at this. And grab, put stuff in now. Look at that. Oh, I better actually top up our juice. We are running low of rocket juice. Alright, perfect. Done. Okay, come on over here. Here we go. Oh, we can't turn her on without a battery. <laughs> yeah, that would make sense, Data. Alright, now we need to put a battery back on this thing. Whew! I'm doing it! I'm doing it! Alright. Um, battery. Battery, battery, battery. It would be under power blocks? Yes, it would be. Battery. Hydrogen engine. Hydrogen engine converts. Hydrogen into power own internal tank. See, I don't know how to set any of that up. That sounds cool, like a hydrogen. So you probably find we need to... That would be our next be best thing. Upgrade the mining turtle, we'll make it version 2, with an actual hydrogen. But for now, batteries seem to be our best best bet, you know. Um, we can't place it. Can't even place it. What do we need? Steel freaking plate. Always steel plate. It should let you at least place the freaking thing. Okay. Alright, so where could we store batteries? Probably right on the side. I don't want them in the way. I don't want them in the way. We could probably flip one there, one there. But I think he's probably perfect. One, two. You know what? I'm going to do three. I'm going to do three and three, you know. Lots of battery power on this sucker. And, whoops. I'm sorry I screwed that one up. There we go. Number nine. All right, again, here, and here. Perfect. All right, now, what does it require most of? Put this sucker together now. We'll do all the steel plate. Yep, do all the steel plate. There's probably going to be enough power right here just to just to do with mining, maybe. Because they come with one, one battery, like one light on already. All right, so now we'll do the rest of the, the rest of them. Alright, come over here. We don't need any steel plate now. We need computers. I think we need a display. We need a couple hundred of that. No, probably a hundred of those. And oof, I don't even know what else, to be honest. Let's just start with that, eh? I keep not memorizing this stuff. An expert would probably memorize the crap out of this and know exactly how much they need. Power cells and computers. That's all we need now, guys. There we go. Done. And then we shall have power again. So, power cells. Do I have any of those? Yes, I do. I can only carry... Tw they're heavy. Power cells are heavy. Hang on. I have to do multiple clips on that one. 20 power cells. Yeah, I can only do one trip at a time. That's nuts. So, all right. Thank God I made these up earlier. <laughs> I think this, that one, is this the same way? Ah, no, it's not the same way, is it? I don't know. Yes, it is the same way. Thank God. I was going to, it was going to drive me nuts if that wasn't the same way. More power cells, please. And keep going. See, I should have enough to land there and that just takes computers now. But I'll put the rest of the power cells together so we have maximum power. Which should give us maximum thrust too. More of these power cells, please. How do they work on mammoth ships on this game? Do they build themselves a... Hang on a second. You can... You could build a ship welder. So to put things together. So you'd probably build a little ship with a welder on front just to put together a mammoth ship. Because doing this manually sucks. I'm just picturing the massive, massive operations they probably have on this game. Alright, that one. One more, guys. And then just computers, which I'll do all of them at once. These battery things, these power cells are legit hard. Alright, then computers. Alright, computers now. And throw that bad boy back in there. Computers. 100 of them, please. Alright, look at this. We're getting somewhere. 
Now we can oh, land, build these right up, make sure they're 100%. 100%. Oh, this one's almost 100%. 100%. Alright, I'll, I'll go there next. I promise. We'll get some more energies. But, uh, all this. This is like, we only had two batteries on the, um, uh, uh, before. So this is literally like, this is like freaking like three times the power there we go and they all have a green light they're upside down no that's gonna bother me ah oh, this one goes down this one goes up ah all right just ignore that guys ignore that i think the ship is still on i forgot to turn it off all right uh jumping in um all right okay um, parking, uh, landing gear unlocked. Oh, yeah, I got heaps of power now. Can we take it for a quick burn? Just a small one? Alright, let's do that. Woo-hoo-hoo! -hoo! Whoa! Wrong button! Wrong button! Whoa, 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 whoa. Wrong button, Data. Rocking side to side is going to make everyone sick. There we go, we can zoom right up. I've got good control, look, see, left, right, spinning around, up, down, down's a bit slow, there's only one thruster for down, there's four for front, so definitely good control there, probably a good thing, left and right seems to be good, perfect, up seems to be the most, but we've got, at full thrust forwards, we've got nine minutes of power, full thrust up, we've got ten minutes of power, sweet, all right, Alright, perfect. Well, we need to charge the batteries up so they're way more than 10 minutes of the power. But especially turning the mining on t the, the rigs of the front. Alright, brake. Oh, I forgot to add brake. I, I got one back thruster. Whoa, she takes forever to pull up, guys. Is that a bad thing? Probably. Alright, pull her down. Alright. This is Mining Turtle requesting a... Uh, Landing clearance for outpost number one. <laughs> Sorry, this is kind of cool. It's got so much power in forward and back, but barely any power to stop yourself. How do I'm going to even do this? Come on, stop. All right. So give yourself some space. All right. There's the little bum end thing. Yep. That's what I've got attached to the bottom. Whoa. Whoa, okay. Bring it down. Slowly, Data. Slowly. Alright, here we go. Slowly. Alright, I need to swing it around. Just sort of give it a 3D-ness. Give it a reverse up a bit. Come down. How do you th how do you know when it's going to lock? And this, she's a little bit off. Hang on. Can I stable that out at all? Yep, there you go. Well, if I can connect this, she'll be right. All right. Back? Yep, back a little bit. Back a little bit. Beep, beep, beep. Come on. All right, down a bit. Oh, oh, she magnetized. What do I do? Press P, press P. Yes! I did it! I did something. She locked and she's fully on this. I think she's a part of the... Bring up our... All right, turn it off. Bring up our control panel on our ship. Oh, I don't even know what that is. Our control panel. Oh, there you go. We actually can see the rest of the grid on the connectors. So we can see the rest of the grid now. We have. Do we have access? We have should have full access now. There you go. So we should theoretically just say I wanted to do. Why has the connector got this stuff in it? Alright, just say I wanted to drag my computer parts into... Where's my large container? This is the large container on the ship. So I drag... Can I drag it in there? No. Oh, okay. I've got to go over there. We'll do. Okay, alright. I'll forget. Go over to the large container. I need an access port. Large container. Drag that in there. And then you should be able to drag this down. Not into the refine. No, you can't. Okay. Oh, she did. Where did she go? Oh, 
No, she, she's still there. Okay, I can't drag it down. That means I can't drag anything up to our large one as either. Okay, I'm still getting used to how this all works. She's connected anyway. Our large port is connected, and it's connected through that, right onto that. Is it because the connector's there? Maybe. Or conveyor? Yeah, I can't, I can't even destroy that. That would literally destroy our thing. Oh, our batteries are all red already. Flame and galah. Is she actually charging? What? Oh, sorry. Wrong button. I almost freaking tried to take off then. <laughs> That's bad. All right, control panel. Uh, information. No, what we want is control panel. And we want, there's our batteries. Stored power should get nothing. And none of them are getting anything. I don't even, oh no, maximum stored power. Fully charged in, boof. Current input, output, see? She is connected. Um, the connector is there. It should pass through, but I think I've made a mistake. I don't know if that conveyor should be there. Hang on. Because it's nothing's charging. Nothing seems to be passing through. This conveyor seems to be screwing me up. Hang on, hang on. I think, I think... And look. Is, is that all yellow? Isn't these meant to be green? Like that one? Okay, I've done something wrong. That's okay. You know, learning as a noob, that's fine. Okay, it's probably the conveyor. I'm just taking a rough guess. Power on, please, Captain. All right, power on. Disengaging from the magnetic. Right, I'm disengaged. Pulling forwards. Go straight forward. And then straight down. Lander. Just, just take it down. Nice and gently. Gently. Perfect. Locked. Okay, I'm locked. Everything's locked. Perfect. Alright, so how about we... It went green. What is doing that? Why did it do that? See, I put the thing on, the whole lot went green. Is it because it's too much stress? We could we could always move it back some. Alright, 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 fine. You know what? Fine. You know what? Actually, she should fit there. I'm going to put a connector directly on top here and see what happens. Yep. Let's go like that. Alright, there's a connector directly onto... Oh, really? Steel plate. Connected directly onto that. There we go. Weld it. Put it together. I'm going to need 130 of them. Hang on. Give me access to that. There's another 100. Alright. A bunch of motors, small pipes, etc. Alright, now, where's an access port? There's an access port. Ah! Okay, the front is an access port right now. I'm just trying a few things, you know? Um, small tube is the next one. Perfect. Construction comp next. Um, there. Couple hundred. Don't know how much it needs. Motor and computer is the last thing. Perfect. Motor and computer. I need a bit more computers data. Computers. Thank you. See if that works better than what we just had it as. Okay. Because, yeah, there. Connector. I don't know if we're using the, even the right connector. Is there a certain type of connector that I need to get? I don't know. Let's fly. Connector up to that one now. Just just to have a look. Alright. Um, here. Fly. Alright. I've taken off. Reverse up. We should be able to reverse directly right over it. Alright. Going in for the second connection here. Whoop. It's a bit higher data. Oh, bit higher data. You're breaking some stuff, man. You fruit loop. 
Alright, that looks about right, eh? Oh, bit over. It just looks different in different angles, see? I can already tell that's a little bit back. Is that going to connect? Are we... Oh, bit on. Alright, connected. Alright, is that connected? Is that... Is that like transferring... Ah, turn that off. Pressing wrong buttons again. Still orange. I don't... I just don't know. There's maybe not enough power to transfer? I have no clue. It is not... Orange is bad, I suppose. Yeah, see, nothing's transferring through. And I don't think we can transfer anything out of the lard. So you can put... We can't even put it in the connector. Unless they're not valid. Yeah, see, I can't drag anything. And you should be able to, right? Right. Hmm. Uh, you should be able to move things around at your at your leisure sort of thing and it just it's not working yeah so you can't you can't drag things directly straight out of it all straight up okay so i've done something wrong all this container doesn't support it because the batteries are not charging is there enough power i i just don't know uh, what is it me or everything's offline what did i do everything is offline even the wind hang on a second data what the flame glow have you just done all right where the frig is everything wind turbines i think i turned the in there we go wind turbine on everything's powering back up wow okay wow i'm once you connected pressing y must connect the entire thing is she receiving power now no she doesn't look like she's receiving any sorts of power i think i have to research yeah have to research because they're orange i can access drill large cargo cop pits through here but that's about it um control and batteries obviously definitely not chart oh whoa. battery yeah see there's no in there's no current coming in and out so i have i don't know i really don't i'm just as lost as everybody else here at least i got it connected or do i have the wrong connector or the wrong storage or the wrong or is it the wrong way is, it can't be the wrong way. We've actually got to connect it directly onto it. It can't be anything. Yeah, yeah. It can't be. Hmm. Okay. Unless they can't talk to each other. They're, they're all built by me. Right? I'm just trying multiple things at this, this point. Oh. Yeah. I've still got access to the, the assembler. Yeah. Yeah, see, I got access to the assembler and everything in the terminal. Just, yeah, nothing's going through. Um, okay, all right. I've obviously screwed something up, okay? Well, I'm going to quickly Google this just to just to see what what I've done wrong because I'm I'm on I'm a learning experience. You you guys are probably screaming at me. But um there is no power coming in the ship. That means our batteries are not charging. It, are the batteries... Alright, I'm pressing Y just to see if it shuts everything down. No, see, they're still charging. Okay. No, they're not. This... So you can control the entire base being connected like this. That's scary. That is literally scary. I'm just going to check if all the blocks are on. Oh, what? The batteries now are getting current inputs, guys. It's charging. Maybe I just had to be patient. Yes, that's great news. Look. Look, current input, current output. The batteries are all charging. Six hours? How do you reduce that? 
Yay! We did it! The, the, the It is charging. Oh, we've even got lights back on board. Look, dude, the lights are on. Yes! Okay. All right. I'm a bit more confident. I think I was rushing. I think I was rushing. But, to be honest with you, I still cannot... Oh, can we? No, we cannot transfer. There's the connector. I can transfer them between connectors. Yeah, okay. It's a really weird setup. These are the, yeah, connectors, large cargo. How do you switch between them? The large cargo is... Sorry, just playing around. I can't even see the large cargo. There's a connector. Oh, wrong connector. Hang on a sec. I've been doing the wrong connector all this time. Let me turn this sucker off. No, so there's two connectors. Interesting. Okay. Yeah, interesting. So you have to transfer them maybe to the connector first, then transfer them over? I have no flaming idea. See, you can transfer them into the connector. Once they're into the connector, you still can't transfer them any further than that. Okay. Oh, you can. I just did. Okay. Hang on. My bad. So, put them in the connector. Where's that connector gone? There. So, I just threw them in the connector to the ship. And then transfer them up to the large cargo. Ah, oh, okay. I'm doing it. Alright. I am... I'm doing it. This is perfect. This is absolutely perfect. See? So I can literally transfer. This is literally what's in the ship right now. And so I can't... Li I, unfortunately, I gotta... I think... Press... Um, filter. There you go. So I can see the large cargo. I can't directly drag anything up to the large cargo. I can now! What the flame and galah? Okay, I could transfer between the cargoes now. Everything seems to be working. Maybe it was just a power problem. Maybe I turned everything off. But she's charging very slowly. As you can see, she's charging. I can transfer items between these two now. No problem. So that means unloading all the resources that we mine is going to be perfect. I just need to pack this crap up. Because we've got, we've already got a landing point there. We've got a second one here, but I'd probably just wind it up. Uh, so it doesn't show up anymore. There's no two connectors. There's just one. And Bob's your uncle. Done. Thank you, thank you. And I'll pop that straight back into here. And I should be able to, if I wanted to, go down to my... Just checking. I'm, so, I'm checking again. Where is it? Large cargo container, drag it straight in. I can. I can literally drag all this stuff into my large cargo. You can drag it around now. Yay! It just must have been power problems. Because it wasn't letting me before. Alright, let's cut all this crap off. I'm gonna, I'll, I'll pack this up later, actually. That's fine. Hurry up and charge! How do we get this thing to charge faster now? What's the ETA, ETA on the battery pack charging? Hang on, I'll check. Jump in. Bring up our information. Bring up, uh, sorry, control panel. Batteries. Seal, still six hours. Can we select all batteries and make like a group of them? No, because it doesn't have information about that group. Just separate batteries. Still six hours. Current input 120 kilowatts. Or K, KW. And uh, yeah, it's, it's going to take a long time to charge all these batteries up. So... Can we make the input 120 watt even higher? How would we do that, you say? Could we add, say, another turbine um, onto this thing? So, we've got a back end here. Why not use it? Why not utilize this? It's connected. It, no. Well, hang on. I'm going to make sure it's connected. Hang on. One second, guys. Um, grab some plate. All right. Let's connect this. I'm going to utilize... No. No, I'm just going to build another one. Screw it. I'm going to deconstruct that one. I don't like it. I think building them too close together, they don't work properly. I don't know. So what I'm doing is just building another one a little bit further away. Uh, 
And one more because I built that one a bit low. And I'll probably fix that up now that I've noticed that huge, huge error. Can I... Yep. Continue that through the ground. Yep. That's fine. That's, that's like barely visible. I just want to double the speed. So and say instead of six hours charge, we could get it in half that. That would be bloody lovely because I'm going to be here for a while. Even AFK. So double it up. If we could double the wind turbines here, then I'm pretty sure that 120 kilowatts should change. All right, there we go. So that's, yep, both. All right, let's get G, put that there, stick that on. What do I need? Interior plate. All right. All right, interior plate. All right, um, interior plate. There we go. Can't believe power's like a huge problem in this. Uh, up. Alright, there we go. Another wind turbine. Another wind turbine. What is it going to take to put together real quick? Right, do that. Do that. So, motors, construct grinder, and computers. Okay, not a problem. Not a problem. At least it's charging as we speak. So I will take 100 of those, computers, and those, please. Get these four, and we'll just have a look and see if it doubles the power output. There, just need motors now. There you go. Alright. I'd build solar, but solar only works during the day. We might try a solar panel. It might be more powerful. Uh, motors. Alright. We should be able to get these freakers going now. Come on. Alright. This thing should be functional on online and generating power in no time. Alright. She's online. And this one. Going online. Well, we still haven't put an ore detector on the front of our ship yet. But I need it to charge. That's the point. We want fully charged. Alright. So we got four individual wind. I've got to, I'm going to deconstruct. Can I deconstruct this one? Screw it. Hang on, hang on. Inventory's full. Ow! Alright, I just want to fix that up before my OCD gets to me. Alright, then we'll go check the ships. So I was 120, wasn't it? Ah, of course! Hang on. I just need a couple of steel plates. Goes and gets 100. Neck minute. <laughs> Alright, um... Boom, there you go. That's brought up finally to the rest of the height. Go ahead and stick that back on. Hopefully we don't have to get too much. No, nope, she's 100%. And just grind it all together. 100%. Alright, let's go have a look. See, now let's land in the ship. Press I. Go to control. Battery. 241. We have doubled the input. Three hours to fully charged. Yes, guys. That means these lights should be going up quite quick and quick and quickly now. So now, how big's a solar panel? Mm-hmm. Solar panel. Solar panel. Solar panel. Whew. They're quite big. But I can stick them on the side here. It's better to go straight up or straight down. Hang on. Oh. Side here, maybe here. See, they don't want to move. Um, oh, no, they do want to move. Okay. We could probably put solar panels on this bad boy. So, wind and solar, if you know what I mean. So, maybe right here. Is there a center to it? There's no center, guys. Alright, what I'll do is build this out, like so. Connect these two together. I know I'm not meant to be building a full bone base here. Alright, there we go. Connect that into that now. Now we can put solar panels along here too. Boom. And you know what? I'll probably put one here too. That's two solar. Boom, and I'll probably put one in the middle for even. But I gotta be careful because obviously I fly in between this stuff. What does it take to put together a solar panel? 
a little bit more deer up. Do I have even solar cells? I don't think I do, guys. I don't have so access to solar cells. Hang on a sec. Do I have access to solar cells? Production. Solar cells. Yes, I do. It requires nickel. All right. Do I have any nickel? Yes, I do. All right, putting 200 of the solar cells on because I don't have any in here. Um, all right, what else did it need? I think we got... Yeah, we got most of that one done. Just be cool to see how much the sun generates, if you know what I mean. There we go. All right, the solar cells is generating anyway. Um, all right, so I can put that back. And it's going to require computers, and these, and these, I think. I think I got that right. I'm uh, putting this together. It requires bulletproof glass, but I'm sh pretty sure to be operational, operational, it doesn't, doesn't need the bulletproof glass. Just like the ship cockpit. If you want to go into outer space, I'm pretty sure you must have the bulletproof glass for that. But I'll just I'll try it anyway. Sun is setting. We got we got limited time, guys. Limited time. How's those solar cells going? Seventy of already. Excellent. Can I have as many as we many as I could take? All right. Let's get this bad boy because two hundred and something, wasn't it? All right. There you guys go. And she's eighty-one percent, but she should be online. See, it's past that line that says, you know, it could work. It just needs bulletproof glass. Do we have access to that bulletproof glass already? Because I could make it 100%. Production, assembler. What is the bulletproof glass? I'll take 100 of those, please. Swap it out. Yay, I can make bulletproof glass. Yay, that's good, that's good news. I could put the rest of it together. I think it requires 30 or so. But she should be online. There we go, we got solar now too. Huh. Oh, only four of them. Whoops. 100% done. 100% done. It's probably only going to work when it's midday, but... Are these facing the wrong way? I didn't know they had a way to face. Oh. See, I don't know what these lights mean. Is it generating power? Hang on. I... Control panel battery. Yeah, it's only gone up a little bit. It's actually outputting right now. Oh, probably because I'm I'm producing. Ah, I forgot about that. Yeah, I think maybe what the lights mean is because yeah, I think that's strength of the sun. I'm just taking a guess because that's going behind the mountain. If you know what I mean. But flaming gala. That looks pretty cool. That does look pretty good. I'll deconstruct this in the middle. But there you go. I think that looks... There you go. I can get rid of that. See? I can literally get rid of this. Press number nine. Yeah. Alright. Okay. Alright, guys. There's not much more to do. I might build two more solar panels on this side just to make it even. And maybe put a strip down the middle, connect these, or turn them around the other way. I don't know. I don't know. But we're going to go ahead and call it. Thanks for watching episode 4 here of Space Engineers. Uh, I'm sorry about all the derpiness. Remember, I am brand new to this game. I'm four episodes in, guys. I've learnt so much already. But that's fantastic. We're getting charged now on our ship. We'll be able to mine next episode, I reckon. I'm going to hook these into there. We'll do that next episode. And probably put a shell, shell on her. But that there looks flaming cool. <laughs> um, that's cool. I think we can access the batteries from here too if we really want to. We don't really have to go in there. There you go. Yeah, we can. All the batteries. Still three hours charge. Pro nah, sun power doesn't seem to do it. I think wind power is what it's all at. <laughs> Triple the wind power of it. Alright guys, thanks for watching. Don't forget if you're enjoying the content, smash all those buttons guys! And I'll catch you all later!